Hi everyone, my name is Amy Ha. I'm a solutions consultant at Appian. Today, I will walk us through the types of AI that Appian offers, broken down into three main buckets, so it's a lot easier for us to grasp. The three buckets include AI skills, Gen AI for business users, and Gen AI for developers. AI is included in the Appian Unified platform, so you can use it along with your workflows, your data fabric, and other key features of the platform, while making sure that your data and AI stay under your control and your application stays compliant with global regulations. We also highly recommend using AI along with humans in the loop for higher value decision making. For more learning resources, make sure to check out the description below and don't forget to like and subscribe. Now let's dive into the first AI offering, AI Skill. AI Skill is a low-code tool for uh, our developers to drag and drop into processes to automate manual and repetitive tasks. The first three AI skills are non-generative AI, including document classification, document extraction, and email classification. These leverage machine learning without generating new content. Now let's take a look at an example of document extraction using our AI skill. To create a new AI skill, we can navigate to our app in designer, select a new object, in this case, an AI skill. And here we have a whole list of use cases that we can create, including classification, extraction, generation, summarization, and PII detection. We also have generative and non-generative AI skills to choose from. In this case, we will see an example of document extraction, non-generative AI. In this example, I have trained this model to take purchase orders as the input to extract the fields that I have identified. On the left-hand side here, I can see order number, order date, vendor name, customer name, a table of items and total as the fields to extract. Since I have trained and tested this model, I can view the performance of it on the right-hand side via metrics, such as the percentage of fields that were identified correctly. I can also dive deeper into the field and document extraction performance to view precision and accuracy of this model to decide if it's ready to be published. With this AI skill, it's a great fit to extract data from structured documents and semi-structured documents. For example, we have purchase orders in this example. For unstructured documents, think contracts, we can use our Gen AI skill to help with that. Unstructured document extraction is one of the use cases that we can leverage Gen AI for in Appian platform. Some other use cases include PII identification, summarization, text generation, etc. All of these Gen AI skills are built upon the Prompt Builder AI skill, which leverages Gen AI to um, have pre built prompts that you can then tailor to fit the use cases that you're looking for. For example, in this case, I have created an AI skill for text generation. And here I have a pre-built prompt that Appian is giving me where I'm telling AI that my company is launching a new product and I would love AI to help me draft a message that we can send to our customers to introduce this product to them. In other use cases, I can go ahead and tailor this prompt to fit my specific use case. Right underneath, we have temperature. The higher the temperature, the more random AI output is. In this case, since I want AI to be creative with a message, I want to set the temperature at 80. I can also provide AI examples of input and output to use as inspiration. And with that, I can go ahead and test the AI skill and voila! The output has the message that AI has drafted for me to send to our customers after further tailoring.
Those were some examples of using non-generative and generative AI in our AI skills to help automate repetitive and manual tasks. Now let's take a look at how business users can leverage our AI in the Appian platform. Here I have an example of an interface where we have tasks and case details. To make it even more convenient for our end users, we have a tool called records chatbot, which is one of the two tools that our business users can leverage in our platform. I can drag and drop this tool into the canvas, configure it further so that the end user can ask any questions about the case details or the tasks. Another tool that our business users can use is Enterprise Copilot. This is a tool where end users can chat with their documents. We can upload all of the documents we want to ask questions about into the knowledge sets that you can see on the left-hand side. On the right-hand side, we have a chatbot experience where as end users, we can ask any questions about all of the documents we have uploaded. In this case, I have asked AI for the latest update for Enterprise Copilot. From there, AI was able to give me a list of the most recent highlights on the feature. It also gave me citation on which document it has got the information from. To view further information of the documents, I can click into any of these boxes to view further information. The third tool that business users can leverage in our Appian platform is Data Fabric Insights AI Copilot. AI Copilot is a tool within our Process HQ where business users can create self-service reports and dashboards on the data that they have access to. And with Appian, we have Data Fabric, so we can generate insights for data across all of these different data sources. In this case, I have selected a report to dive deeper into for average purchase amount by vendor. On the right-hand side, I have asked AI Copilot for two insights and actions I can take based on this report. From there, AI was able to give me the two insights as well as recommended actions. So as you can imagine, this will make it a lot easier and faster for business users to get insights from their data. As of this release 24.3, we also have a preview where end users can use AI Copilot to ask questions about their whole data catalog without having to choose a specific report. With that, we have Records Chatbot, Enterprise Copilot, and Data Fabric Insights AI Copilot as the Gen AI tools that business users can leverage on the Appian platform. Now, let's take a look at how developers can also leverage AI on Appian. On Appian, developers can use AI-generated test cases and AI-generated sample data. In this example, I have a record type for customers where I can view the data model to see the different fields and data type. From there, I can ask AI to generate sample data for me in a matter of seconds. As a solutions consultant, I have built plenty of demos where I would have to go on to mock data tools to generate data, copy it into our uh, data, data table on the cloud database, sync it to our record type, etc. That was easy and it was using low code, but it's not as fast as what AI can do for me now. And as you can see, now we have a list of sample data based on the field names and the data type that I have identified. If I would like to give AI additional instructions, for example, if I want the data to have customer details who live in South America, AI can be, um, AI can refresh the data to reflect that update. The other tool that developers can use is AI generated test cases. Now, as we all know, testing is crucial, right? With AI, we can make it even faster and easier. In this example, I have an expression rule to query customer data. Instead of creating new test cases manually like before, I can have AI do so for me. It will also 
keep in mind different scenarios that it highly thinks we should include in our test cases. And in a matter of seconds, we will see a list of test cases, the outputs, the assertions to add to our test cases. From there, we can click into each of these cases to view the expression, the output value, and we can also make changes to our inputs, save it for our test case. And with that, we have seen examples of how developers can leverage Gen AI in the Appian platform to make it easier for development. Today, we have covered the three main buckets of AI types Appian offers including AI skills, Gen AI for business users, and Gen AI for developers. In this AI era, you have different options to carefully insert AI into your processes, your applications, to help automate these manual repetitive tasks and make the experience of developers and business users a lot better with the Appian platform. Again, AI is a tool in the Appian toolbox that you can use, and we highly recommend using it along with keeping humans in the loop for key decision making. All of these release features are available as of this release 24.3, so make sure to give it a try. Thank you.